know, has, no, uh, yeah, has elaborated on uh, his comments and kind of uh, confirmed Uh-oh. the stuff with Bruce Lee. The, he uh, commented on the controversy. You know, the the guy yes. who played Bruce Lee in Once Upon a Time mm-hmm. in Hollywood, they said that's not really a, a proper representation of him. He's too cocky. He's too arrogant. I don't oh, think the guy that, who played him said that? Uh, well, no, no, no. What the, happened the was... Sister. Uh, oh, uh, of, yeah. Bruce Lee. Yeah, not the guy that played him. Right. Uh, Bruce Lee's family came okay. out and said I read that, that yeah, they were I, I, upset about it. So okay. this is what he said. This is from Variety, and uh, Tarantino explains that, and this is a quote, the way he was talking, I didn't just make a lot of that up. I heard him say things like that to that effect. If people are saying, well, he never said he could beat up Muhammad Ali, well, yeah, he did. Not only did he say that. But his wife, Linda Lee, said that in her first biography I ever read. She absolutely said that. So he's taking stuff from the first biography that Linda Lee wrote that Mm. the research is saying – he's saying otherwise, that this is actually a proper representation of Of his kind of character. But then he also goes into why could Brad Pitt essentially beat up Bruce Lee? Well, he wanted him him to win originally, and then Brad Pitt said – Dude, it's Bruce Lee. Yeah. So, and, and it was uh, not. But that he brings up the idea of it's a fictional character mm-hmm. that I created in Brad Pitt's character Cliff, and so I'm saying that this guy was a Green Beret. He fought in World War II. He could beat Bruce Lee. Can Brad Pitt br- beat Bruce Lee? No. Bruce right. Lee would kick Brad Pitt's ass. So that's what he's saying. It's a fictional character. That's why it happened. Because uh, he's I he's mean, setting up the story for the character. I don't want to give any spoilers, but clearly this wasn't the only creative liberty that Tarantino took right. in the film. Right. Correct. Uh, so I think that with the vibe of the film, he's allowed to make the decisions he wants to make. Absolutely. I told you guys when I left the movie that this scene, regardless of Bruce Lee, it didn't sit particularly well with me. Yeah. yeah. Um, for a different for reasons. For a lot of people too. Yeah. I still need to see it, man. I gotta. But, I love it. Yeah. Yeah. but I am it. I am I sitting here and saying that was not Tarant that Tarantino had bad intentions or that that he was not able to do that and he shouldn't have done that? Absolutely not. No, it's it's a his movie choice. and it's in choice. the movie right. that he made. Right. Yeah. yeah, it just wasn't particularly right. for me. But as somebody's family member, I also understand why Bruce Lee's sister would be upset well, about that. But what she said, though, inside of that same article was she understood why he right. made the choice that he made. And she get it for what he was doing. It's just mm-hmm. it's not, it wasn't accurate to the representation of the of who she knew, mm-hmm. um, which I think is a fair statement. And she's right. like, yeah, yeah she, she knew wants exactly. to second, set the record straight. She even said, do you look at the title of the movie? And that's what the movie is. So uh, yeah. I love the movie. I, want, I actually want to go see it again. I can't wait for it to uh, come out on Blu-ray. So that's probably when I'll be able to see it.